Hey everybody, what is going on? Physics back again with another Madden 15 video and we did receive Bo Jackson, pretty sweet player here. What's really strange I felt is the more I play with him, he's got really high speed, agility, and acceleration. But for whatever reason, when I play with him, it doesn't seem like he's that fast. It's so weird. But anyways, we got an extra Frozen Tundra as well available. And what we're going to do today is we're going to open a Game Changer pack. There's two purchases available. We're only going to get one though. And it contains a gold or better badge, two ultimate freeze items, and at least 10 gold or elite players and four team items. So uh, we're going to go and we're going to open one of these since I do have enough points to get one. Hopefully we get something amazing. And first off the get-go, we have the gold badge. Uh, we got the Dolphins offense. Uh, we're going to add that one to the set. We are going to get Kellen Winslow, who isn't what he used to be, unfortunately. So he's only a 79. Probably going to go auction that off. And we get Gerald Hodges, right outside linebacker. Not too bad uh, compared to my other... who he's got great speed. Holy crap. Considering my Preston Brown is my starting right, uh, it's pretty it's pretty close. I'm probably going to have to look at that and debate that later. Uh, a lot faster of a linebacker, so he's going to be a real good pickup. We got the Viking Stadium, which I already have. And we got Gerard Mayo once again. Damn, another Gerard Mayo. So we got two really good pickups so far. Um... I guess the gold badge is somewhat of a decent pickup. And we got Brandon Carr as a corner. Is he uh, fast at all? Maybe he's got some value. Um, eh, not too quick at all, really. But definitely going to get something back for him in an auction. And we got, again, a Frozen Tundra. I've already completed five of them. We got Anthony Spencer. Once again, I scooped him up last time in the openings. Um, pretty decent, I guess. But nothing I'm going to be keeping. Vikings home. I'm going to add that one to the set as well. And we got Oliver Vernon, who is a right end. Um, I believe he isn't as good as my other starting right end. I believe it's Michael Johnson, right? And Michael Johnson, Johnson is just a beast. And let's just not forget, he is 6'7". So, um, John Harbaugh, gonna already have him to the set. Okay. And boom! David DeCastro. Not bad. Right guard, but unfortunately... Um, I, I got Kyle Long on the Thanksgiving edition for my right uh, my right guard, so it's not really going to do much um, of an improvement. I, maybe I can play him on the left side and uh, replace him with Fusco. I pro probably that's what I'll do, even though his points might drop a little bit. But uh, definitely going to go with and move move him over to the left side, most likely if he is uh, if his stats don't drop way too much. So we got Dwayne Allen. Tight end, and how much of a speedster is he? Because I do have pretty good tight ends. My tight end game is pretty sweet. I got uh, Rivera, who is just uh, team of the week, and that's pretty good right there. He's a real good speedster, real good catching as well. So probably going to end up auctioning him off as well. Another ultimate freeze, Frozen Tundra. And we got Ten Gid, who uh, is, is, is at least got some speed on his belt. Have some value in there. He does have a little bit of value where I might be able to get rid of him. And Chris Clemens. So, um, uh, free safety. Oh, he's actually got pretty decent speed and acceleration. He's He might have some value. People do like fast for uh, free safety. So, definitely a pretty good solid pickup on packs. Gerald Hodges, not too bad. Might end up uh, taking over Patrick Brown spot. We got Gerard Mayo, who, according, you know, taking a look at my other middle linebackers, isn't much of a improvement, but he will, you know, he might get some playing time. Not too sure yet. Borland's pretty, pretty good as well. So uh, we're gonna see how that pans out. But uh, we got Brandon Carr, who isn't gonna get any sort of playing time. I don't believe so, mainly because he is lacking in speed. And considering how I have my corners are pretty stacked. Pretty stacked cornerbacks. Uh, I don't think he's going to get much playing time at all. And of course, we got, oh, of course, uh, Oliver Vernon. And uh, David DeCastro is probably the, hands down, I mean, he's an elite. We got the biggest pickup there. And that's probably going to be the end of that. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. I got my actual uh, uh, seasons coming up. I ended up editing a lot of the videos out. So we're going to have about, 
uh, four games that I've played already, and those are going to go up in the next you know day or two. So expect to see those. Um, if you guys enjoy the video, please drop a like and subscribe for more Madden 15. I mean, like I said, I have my seasons coming up, my ultimate season coming up pretty in the next like day or two. So stay tuned for that if that's what you guys like from the first one. I know I did week one, and I haven't done week two, three, or four. So those are coming up. Drop a like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.